Yeah, pretty stupid, wasn't it, Gracie? I bet you don't do that again. Can't even get it out of your mouth. Oh gosh, this stinks. You better get back here, Gracie. Well, our dog found a skunk. And we tried hard to get her to let go of it. And it finally sprayed her because she picked it up and jerked it and slinging it around and it sprayed her. And it stinks. <sighs> Dumb dog. You can see everywhere where it sprayed too. Ugh. I don't know how. I'm not in the mood with my allergies to get that off the dog. Oh my gosh. There it is. See it? <laughs> It's going right back in its little hole. Oh my goodness. Well, that seems to be its little home. And the cat's like all upset, like meow, meow, meow. Even the cat backed up when it saw it and took off. <laughs> I guess the dog will learn. Oh my gosh. Ew, it stinks so bad. Ugh. Oh, she rolled on that ground and she spit and tried to cough it up. She's rolling everywhere trying to get that skunk smell off of her. Oh my gosh. Not good. Okay. So I'm making soil, picking up cherry tree limbs, or apple limbs. Ooh, man, that stinks. Dadgummit. Anyway, there's the onions. And getting some of this area cleaned up. My husband's working on a project. It's not a silage tart, but I figure, what the heck. I just took the sand out of it. Oh my gosh, that skunk stinks. So these are the rows that I'm just going to have to plant in because I just don't have enough money for those raised beds. Was that roll and a half was over 900 almost almost $1,000. Ah, it's expensive. So I went ahead and had my husband make me an extra bed right in here. Because it is under the shade. Ooh, that wind's blowing and that skunk stinks. <coughs> oh, that's gross. <coughs> Yuck. <coughs> Can't believe the dog so upset with her for not listening to me. So that manure is all on the top. I'm going to take my little claw and put that all through that soil. Put a layer of soil on the top. That'll be some rich, rich, rich soil. And in here, that's where I had the cherry tomatoes last year. And the Bermuda it just chokes it out. The Bermuda's wicked and then the blackberries so I'm gonna have to figure something out I haven't figured it out yet but I'm going to any ideas for me help me out all right let's go in here and check out the seedlings because oh, that smell is about to gag me so as soon as it warms up that basil really take off I left something running over there. All kinds of zinnias. Now bee balm, it's going to be a while before it comes up. And I finally got that moringa planted. I found some moringa seed. Some really high quality moringa seed. So <clears throat> I had moringa going before the fire and it all burned it was big too it was so sad so now i'm starting over finally 
Look at the peppers and eggplants. Oh my goodness. I've never done the Tonda Bianca. It's an Italian eggplant. I'm pretty excited about it. And then, ah, trying to get in here. The jokes. I probably didn't plant enough of those. I love, love, love artichokes. Oh, see, the life bags aren't up there. They're cruising around now. Look at the babies. Oh my goodness, look at them. Tickle me. Freaking happy. Look, ladybugs everywhere. I love ladybugs. They are just so beneficial. I got all kinds of weeds in my citrus trees. They're blooming. And it smells so good in here. Minus the wind blowing in where the skunk sprayed back there. Oh my goodness. Oh, that dog. It's bad. One time she got a sweet little opossum and it made me so mad. Opossums eat a lot of ticks, guys. I want them around. I'm all for everything that eats ticks. Man, I'll, uh, I'll happily keep them on the farm. You don't see them until nighttime anyway. They don't bother anything. They don't carry rabies, so they don't hurt anything. <clears throat> I never got my pruning finished, and look. Oh, it's way too early. I wanted to take these two limbs off of there. I just didn't get it done. I might still go ahead and do it. This is a rich limb cherry. And when we ordered it again and planted it in 2015, it was a tiny little stick. And it's doing quite well. And then I got some Renier cherry trees. Really like them, but it's too early. Too early for this stuff to bloom. I'm not happy about it. Oh my goodness, guys. There's just so much to do. And my husband's not going to be able to help me. So I'm trying to figure this out. Which, ugh. <clears throat> that <clears throat> skunk is really bothering my allergies. I guess I'm going to have to go give the dog a tomato sauce bath. But y'all take care.